Is this small next generation Xbox console the right console for you? Well, there's a lot to love about it and a few things to take note of. So here are the five things you need to know about the Xbox Series S. Did you know the Xbox Series S is 60% smaller than the Series X? It's actually the smallest Xbox ever, making it easy to place on a shelf or even take with you to a friend's house in a backpack. Plus, it's got a smaller price tag to match, costing only £250 in the UK or $300 in the US. That doesn't mean you're missing out on the next generation console experience though. It's true the Series S doesn't have all the power that the more expensive Xbox Series X does, but for its low price tag it is unmatched. Graphical features that make a big difference to how your games look and feel are all still a big part of the Xbox Series S. Variable refresh rates and ultra low latency to make lag and game stutters a thing of the past. Plus, variable rate shading and direct X ray tracing will give every bit of gameplay that next gen sheen. It's a powerful little box. The Xbox Series S has three times the GPU performance of the previous Xbox console generation thanks to its new velocity architecture. So if you're wondering how much better the Series S is than the Xbox One for playing games, the answer is quite a bit. One way the Xbox Series S has shaved off that extra bulk and saved a few pennies in its price is by ditching the disk drive. Of course, some people the disk drive is a must have, especially if you tend to buy pre-owned games or if you have a lot of physical games on disk you want to keep playing. Avoid the Series S and go for the Series X in that case, but for most of us, digital only will be no big deal. That's the way Xbox seem to be headed too, with more titles hitting Xbox Game Pass every day. For those of you who aren't in the know, Xbox Game Pass is a bit like Netflix for gaming. You pay a monthly subscription fee and you get access to hundreds of games, old and new. Huge titles like Forza Horizon 5 and Halo Infinite have gone straight onto Game Pass the moment they're released. And if you're worried about spending hours waiting for digital games to download if your internet isn't the fastest, don't be. With digital titles, you can pre-download them before the game is released. That way you can jump straight into the action on launch day and not miss a second of valuable gaming time. SSD or solid state drive storage has been used for a while in gaming computers but for consoles it is the latest and greatest thing and no wonder it can have a massive impact on the way you play. Compared to traditional mechanical hard drive storage the new lightning fast SSD is way faster and helps power the new Xbox's velocity architecture. That means your games load in the blink of an eye. Loading screens between levels can be pretty much eliminated if the developer wants to. Now one scene can seamlessly blend into another without you having to wait around. You can even switch between two games without missing a beat thanks to quick resume. This for me is the most instantly noticeable step up from last gen as when I go back and play games on my Xbox One, the load times seem to last forever compared to the super zippy Series S. The downside of this super fast SSD storage is that of the 512 gigabytes the console comes with, only 364 gigabytes is usable. So you may want to invest in some external storage, so make sure you check out our video which explains all your storage options. One of the big differences between the Xbox Series S and the Series X is the resolutions which they each target. Although the Series S can't quite match the Series X's raw power to play games at 4K at 120 frames per second, it can still hit an impressive 1440p at 60fps and even 120fps in some titles. That's 2K quality and still with an awesome frame rate and a little box can even surprise you by outputting some less demanding games at a native 4K 60. Anyway, unless you have a 4K TV or monitor, the Xbox Series X's power might be a little bit wasted. If you're not ready to invest in a 4K setup yet, the Xbox Series S is perfect. 
you'll be getting the best your TV can handle without paying extra for something you can't really use. And even if you do have a 4K TV, it will use some trickery and upscale the image so it looks awesome no matter what. With so many free to play games being incredibly popular, you may be looking for a cost effective way to jump into Fortnite, Warzone, Rocket League or Halo Infinite with your squad and this is where the Series S shines. With the low price of the console, you now no longer need to buy Xbox Live Gold to play free to play multiplayer games online with your friends, which means you could buy the Series S console just play free to play games and not have to spend another penny. Which is great news if you want to get into gaming but not spend a small fortune. Find out how the Series S is getting even more powerful thanks to some AMD Fidelity FX Super Resolution magic by clicking the card on screen right now.